chances are that you're looking for jobs in Costa Rica, right? And my video popped up. Now, who am I? Well, my name is Muriel. I moved to Costa Rica with my family, including two growing up kids, thanks to my online work in Costa Rica. Yes, I work for myself and I do not have to have a job in order to be in Costa Rica as long as I want. And uh, chances are that you can um, get something out of my video that I posted today on my channel because I was thinking how can I help those looking for jobs in Costa Rica how can I inspire them that affiliate marketing online uh, an entrepreneur business online the way that I have set it up is possible um, my guess is that about 90% of the people doubt themselves. They don't know where to start. They don't know who to trust. They think affiliate marketing is everything about chasing people, which is all, I think, uh, a created problem. That's not real. So I'm here to bulldozer away with my today's Costa Rica content on the channel because I edited right after this intro, um, a training video that I provided about two years ago. It was more or less uh, during the lockdowns that I was invited to speak to train for a big entrepreneur international event. Um, usually I go to, the, to these events offline and I'm invited to provide training. You might think, huh, but you only always walk on flip flops and in you know in, in tiny sum, summer dresses but on those events i'm standing on my high heels and my cocktail dresses on stage because that's what i love too but i just want to show you that you can be the way you are uh, and build a thriving business online so you never have to look for jobs in costa rica anymore um, before I'm gonna share that video with you and touch on more content that can teach you something today, consider to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more information about Costa Rica coming, then just subscribe by tapping that little icon you see here somewhere on the screen, tap the bell so you get notified every time I upload new content or when I go live, it's always Costa Rica related. And um, yeah, with that being said, um, if you are serious about coming to Costa Rica and you're seriously looking for work in Costa Rica and you don't want to be underpaid and have a lot of insecurity because jobs pay overall not the same as in the country that you're coming from, if that is um, North America, Canada, Europe, it's my experience that I was so glad that I already have my thriving laptop business and as a coach online, teaching people how to build online businesses, I feel obligated to share this mindset training with you because success online has not everything to do with skill set or how techy you are or how many people you know. It has to do with having a rock solid mindset for success, to learn new skills and to just get started even when you don't see the whole staircase. It has everything to do with following a mentor. And if you don't have time to watch this whole video right now, down below, you'll find two links. One is leading to the mini training <coughs> that is uh, in a nutshell, teaching you what it takes to build a business online. It is a tip your toe in the water type of training for those who do not want to commit in building a business online yet or perhaps never and there is a link leading to my website where you also can book a free orientation call with me if you are bloody serious and you feel the time is now and you feel like i want to work with you muriel i want you to be my coach you can we can find out if we're the right fit we have to discover if you qualify for my coaching program because it's not for everyone but i do have some open spots coming up soon and I would love to have super awesome people from all around the world. It might be you to work with me in my coaching program called Be The Master. So with that being said, here is the training. Make notes, be serious, and then decide to go ahead and tap one of the two links below my video to take action on your desire to work in Costa Rica online for yourself and be independent and location free. How does that sound? I hope you enjoy 
and uh, talk soon. Speaker is an amazing speaker. Uh, not only is Mur Muriel a uh, life coach and a business coach and an entrepreneur, but she is an international speaker and she has done some pretty amazing things with her life. She and her husband, Dirk, are business partners and their whole journey got started way back in the day. And uh, Muriel had to jump in back in 2013 when Dirk's uh, restaurant unfortunately experienced bankruptcy. So Muriel knew, hey, we're going to fight. We're going to get back in this game. We're going to make this thing work. So she got to work building her skills online and has uh, you know, taken that 23 years of experience that she had coaching and mentoring hundreds of people around the world in the care and health industry and said, you know what? I can take those skills along with what I've learned with uh, the online marketing side of this and actually start really helping people. And so she was able to do in less than two years, 2015, she turned around and she was able to fire her boss so she could spend more time with Dirk and their two kids started to become an influencer online. By the way, if you know who I'm talking about, if you know Muriel Dikema, give us a shout out in the chat. Give me a big thumbs up. Who does not love Muriel, right? She's amazing. So she has turned out, uh, tur turned into one of the biggest influencers when it comes to video and, mess and uh, follow up messages with emails, messenger, you name it. Huge influencer on Facebook and YouTube, uses the law of attraction plus that inner game that you have to have to be a champion in business and life. And in 2018, Muriel and Dirk made the big jump. They left the Netherlands. Now, come on now, the Netherlands, beautiful place. You've never been to the Netherlands. You gotta know, they were leaving a beautiful place for paradise of Costa Rica, where they live on their, get this, mango farm with their two children, their two dogs, and 180 mango trees, ladies and gentlemen. If that's not unique, if that's not awesome, I don't know what is, but you know what? Don't just take my word for it. Listen up to Muriel Dikema because she's coming out here right now to melt your face. Give a huge San family love and welcome to Muriel Dikema. Come on out, my friend. <laughs> Oh my goodness! <laughs> I, uh, if 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 you do see me blushing, you know it's because I'm super blushing. Thanks for this. You make me speechless with this intro. Uh, I have to squeeze myself. Like, is this about me? I don't feel I'm anything special, but apparently you have gathered this information, and uh, I feel super humble to be here as a special trainer. Um, for everyone here, um, I'm so excited. I was scrolling through the chat and I didn't have time to um, to uh, to respond uh, to the chat uh, because I was listening to everything. And um, what I would love to do is to just dive right in. But before I do, I wanted to give Misha Wilson a special thank you. I am so grateful that Dirk and I once found the Super Affiliate Network. Um, it was still back in the Netherlands. Uh, so before I'm going to dive in my training, first of all, thank you. Um, this is a very special community. And in the time when we were still dreaming about uh, moving to Costa Rica, we did already things online, but we're not quite there yet. It was the Super Affiliate Network that lifted us up and that gave us that that place to learn and grow, to get the final stuff in place, to, to make it happen, right? So uh, yeah, I cannot stretch that enough. Forever grateful for Misha Wilson and the Super Affiliate Network. Now I'm here to, to share some things with you about how to use story to increase your profit uh, but before I do, I want you to know that in anything that you're about to learn and, and, and do, and by the way, it's super hot here in Costa Rica, and I didn't want to put my van high because you're going to hear, or my air conditioning is going to say, so it is super warm, so you know, um, but uh, it is overall everything that you will be learning at this event um, with me to kick off as a, as a guest you have to know that having mentors, like for me, everything changes by finding a mentor. 
uh, finding a mentor who guides you through specific steps, right? And if you dream about online success for whatever reason, right? Then it is important that you have someone who, who basically guides you step by step. And in a super affiliate network, you have these amazing advisors, right? Uh, I've had the honor to meet a lot of them because before the whole COVID and this virtual stuff uh, is, is now ruling the world, I happen to go to a lot of offline events. I have been to a couple of um, uh, super affiliate network offline events and I've met so many people. So again, I cannot stretch enough how, how valuable having mentors are. It was for myself, like the, the kickoff for my business without mentors and without a company like Super Affiliate Network, I wouldn't have been where I am today. So, and now to touch back on, um, so by the way, I'm from the Netherlands. So sometimes I struggle with my words or now I'm learning Spanish. So I'm all over the place with the with, uh, language bloopers. So, um, but let me take a, a glass of a zip of water first. I got really, really um, uh, blushing because when I hear my own story, I, I hardly sometimes can believe that this is really me, right? And for everyone who doesn't know me, I want you to know that my path from being, you know, in a big bankruptcy debt, working as a social worker in the Netherlands to where I am today didn't happen overnight, right? And I was nothing special and I still feel that I'm nothing special but I learned a couple of things along my way and uh, yeah that's what I'm about to share for you to have a kind of a shortcut you, that you don't have to have to, to to overthink a lot of things that I had to overthink when I got started online I didn't I, I, I learned a lot of things that I'm about to share with you now because uh, most people who are brand new online um, they um, tend to focus on what they not are yet. So if you hear my story, you think, oh, I could never do that. You know, I was, I was, I didn't know, I, I could copy paste, I could copy, hardly copy paste, right? So we tend to focus on what we don't have, but I want you to think about what you do have, right? So if you have no results yet, if you have no technical skills yet, if you have no self-confidence yet, if you have not an inner circle around you who, who believes in your goals and dreams, then don't worry because I'm going to share with you in my training today things that you already have, even when you're not aware of it. So if you don't have pen and paper there, like I'm like old school, I'm always like also at the Super Affiliate Network event, always writing books full of notes. So take a time to, uh, to grab a pen and paper or notepad because I'm going to firstly share my screen really quick to share you something funny, basically about where my story began. And then I will dive into the, to the content of today, because that is what you came for, right? To learn things. And if you want to reply below, if who is here to learn some awesome things that you can apply starting now, just give me a yes, 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 because that helps me to pipe up to know that you're still here. Um, Woohoo! Thank you. Yeah, like, I need this because you know at offline events you you can look the people in the eyes and I see a lot of you all there, but like I need your I need your I need your energy, right? So keep me sharp. Um, just keep those comments coming. I see them. Uh, so yeah, that helps me to uh, to present this training the best I intended to. Thanks so much. I'm so excited. So uh, let me share really quick my screen for something that I put here. Hold on. Let me just drag this here. So this is something. This is not a special presentation whatsoever. Can you all see my screen? Just say yes. Awesome. So this is where my journey began more or less before the journey began. That's perhaps funny, but this is a little bit more about myself that most people haven't seen. This is the year 2002 where Dirk and I were heavily in love. We met in the same bar where we both worked. This was a Petit Camion or Acadiana. And this is like the, the secret part of our story that I'm not really sharing often, but we were, we were childless. We were 
we, we worked in a bar. We didn't have commitments. We didn't have a family yet, but we did have big dreams, right? So we worked in a bar and here's basically where we decided to travel the world and look at our smiley young faces, you know, nothing about that bankruptcy yet and, 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 and the path that would follow after. But I want you to see just two people, young people, uh, we were, this was in the year 2002, right? So we were um, at the end of our twenties and uh, this was who we were. Um, and, 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 and what happened was basically this, um, let me do this. We traveled the world. It was paradise. Like I was in a bubble for a little bit over a year, more or less one and a half year. We traveled. This was Thailand. We watched elephants. This was basically a dream that came true back then. We just you know, quit our jobs in the bar because there was work for everyone, right? That time there was a jobs all over the place. So we were like, you know, we we're going to quit our jobs and travel the world. So that's what we did. And uh, we backpacked through Southeast Asia. We started overland to China. Um, sometimes we took a break in Thailand, but we also traveled Central Asia. This is Kyr Kyr Kyrgyzstan. This is the where where almost no tourists are. This is a nomadic horse. Like I, we had those epic, epic, epic stories we created here. Seeing the world, it was an offline world. Uh, I, I could hardly send emails back home, but this is where we were. We were on this dream, traveling, and um, but this is where something, a big jump forward, right? And this is where the real, how do you say that? A big quantum point in life happened that was very characterizing for my story. Uh, and that is starting a family. So this is our young family. It's a big jump because our daughter was born in 2004, right after we came home from traveling. And with having a daughter, the responsibility was big because you, we needed to generate income. I had my, uh, my job as a social worker because it was not okay for me to work in a bar. And, you know, I was a social worker. That's what I was educated for. And then our second baby came. And meanwhile, they already had uh, two restaurants running. And it was, you know, basically this is my why. This has always been my why. This was 2000. Uh, and nine, I posted this a little bit later. Um, here, he was born five December two thousand and nine, and this is this has always been my anchor overall. So I don't know what your why is, but it's definitely for me my family. And the thing is that this may look really really cool. This was the house where we lived. It was like you know. Just a simple house with not so much space. We drove a very old Mercedes Benz and the kids were there and I was standing there. I smile, but actually deep in my heart, I was super lonely. Dirk was never home. He was always working in his restaurants and um, I was a social worker and basically a broke social worker. And we both talked about a lot about our dreams to travel again, to show our kids the world, because you have seen those pictures, washing elephants in Thailand, horseback riding in Kyrgyzstan, um, you know, epic, epic, epic memories, but life got in the way. We had a family and we were only working, working, working. And basically our life was killing our dreams. And that was not how we wanted it. So this is really all happened in between. And then the journey started. The journey started well, because as it was already explained, a big breaking point in life. And that was basically a big bankruptcy, not any ways for me to pay off that. And uh, yeah, it brought us online. And it brought us online with big dreams and with a big motivation. This is where we are today, but what happened? Meanwhile, and I'm going to share that with you because I have a couple of action points for you that you can take away if you pay attention and make lots of notes. And if you have the guts and the, and the motivation and just the energy to implement them, you can create anything. You can create the life of your dreams. Uh, let me see what is the next picture. Yeah, this is where I am. I'm sitting here at my office. If I turn my screen, <laughs> look. This is where I am. You see, this is my stage. This is my office. This is not just 
a house. And, um, and this is what it's about. But yeah, you know what? Let me show this, this one first. This is important. And then I'm going to dive in the content of today and put you to work and in a very inspiring way. So chase your dreams, share your vision, share your story, inspire and transform. I want you to write this down right now. Chase your dreams, share your vision, share your story, inspire and transform. And I will stop share because, hold on. Let me drag this a little bit to the left because I just want to look you in the eyes and put my laptop back where it was. So are you still with me? So I am nothing special, you know. Um, everyone here came here for a reason. Who has a specific reason or a big reason why to get started online? Just let me hear some yeses, right? If there was something that triggered you in life, that brought you to the super affiliate network, perhaps you were searching online, perhaps, you know, you found a video, a post of some kind of ad that, and then you saw Misha on a, a, some kind of video. Yes, so most people have a why. Now, who thinks that they're, that they don't know enough or that not good enough to be successful, to create the life of, of your dreams, right? I was there when, when you saw me, Okay, when you saw me, well, back then, in, in front of that Mercedes with the kids, you know, around me, I could never imagine that I would have an online business um, because I thought I was not techy enough. I thought that I was not professional enough, that I, I didn't have results to show. I didn't even know what a link was, right? And I didn't have technical skills. I didn't have the self-confidence. So I was there, right? And... Um, here, you see, people doubt themselves. I'm reading, you know, and this is very, very important. Most people doubt themselves and I hear you and I'm going to bulldoze that away, right? Because doubt is human. Everyone doubt themselves. I'm not gonna say, well, make it disappear because it's a feeling you have. But what you can do is you can work with it, right? Because what I'm about to share with you, what I have done from moment one that I started online and I found out that I couldn't copy, I couldn't pretend I was someone else. I, um, I want you to understand that I realized one day that the only thing I already had and what I was good at was being me. I was Muriel and, and, and you are Linda and you are Coral and you are, you know, you are Peter and you are, Milan, right? There are people here. You are you. And there's people out there looking for an authentic, for an authentic voice. They are looking for someone to follow, someone who can identify that they can identify with. So if you think, well, what do I have to offer, right? Uh, because your circumstances are not perfect, but you have this dream. Just look in the mirror and look at yourself in the eye and know that you have you. And if you think, well, I don't even grasp what this business is all about. You don't have to understand all the techie things before you take the leap and fully get started. And that's by the way, a key. I want you to remember this. You cannot tip your toes in the water to achieve all your goals and dreams. You have to take a big leap and it's scary. But most people overthink and they think, well, what do I have to offer? I don't have results, I don't have proof, but you have you. And this is what I've learned, to be my authentic me with all my language bloopers. Remember my English wasn't perfect, I'm Dutch. My English is still not perfect, but I decided in the beginning that I had to be perfect, perfectly English. I was pretending to be different. I was dressing up when I was doing a video and I was like, and then I found out I have to be myself. Uh, so you have you. If you have you, you have your business and you can inspire people. And I want you to know this. I want you to try to answer and I'm gonna read in the, in the comments below. What type of business is affiliate marketing online here? What, what, you know, what is it actually about? Is it about techie things? What is it actually about? What, what, what is it about? What can you bring to people, right? Yeah, I see helping people, I see education, I see, yeah, freedom, biz opportunity, 
okay, it's about solving people's problem. All good answer, but there is one big thing that I want you to remember overall as an umbrella. And that's where your mission starts with you, even when you just when you didn't even got started yet, but you're watching this because you got this event ticket and you're like, what is this all about? And who is she? And who's Michelle Wilson? That's all fine. But this is, this is about transformation. This online business thing is about transforming, transformation, transforming yourself, but also inspiring others, helping others to transform. So you are the vehicle yourself. Results are not important. You know what is important? Your vision is important. That you lead people is important. That you that you that you trust the process and that you can inspire people with positivity, right? So this is basically the key of what I've done from the moment I started to grasp this. That I was the business. If people ask me in the beginning, but what is this business all about? And I remember the beginning, I start to, to explain, this is affiliate marketing. Well, what is affiliate marketing? And how does it work? How do you earn commissions? The, my, you know, one of my mentor friends uh, told me one day, why are you explaining it? You should not explain it. It's the same concept as here. You should not be the, expla expl the person who is explaining it. Let Misha do the work, <laughs> right? Misha has videos to do all the explaining. You are the business. You are the example. This is what it's about, right? So seeing you as the business, your biggest uh, marketing asset is your vision and your story. And how to use your story to increase your profit. That is what it's about. Your story can be wrong. That's the cool thing. There is not a bad story. Well, there's one big, big note that I want you to write down and remember overall. Don't go wrong with this. While you go and you're going to, um, to implement what I'm about to share, don't write about problems that you're right in the middle of yet. Just start sharing your story about problems as soon as you have overcame them. That is an important key. So while you're going to share your story and use your story, like my story, the bankruptcy, et cetera, et cetera, I was not talking about that problem when I was right in the middle of it, right? In the beginning, my story was just my vision. It was like, hey, I want to break free from my job and I want to move abroad and travel with my kids. But the moment that we overcame our financial hurdle, I added pieces to my story. So don't start sharing problems while you're still in it. And that's a magical key. Don't forget this. Promise me, say yes if you promise me not to just you know, spread problems and, and all the things that you're concerned about right now, because it's not gonna attract the right people. It's gonna attract whiners and you want to inspire, remember? So what is important is that you're going to be able to learn how, how your pain and your struggle and your story can become your biggest marketing asset. Now, why is that, right? Well, perhaps you can remember when the first thing, time or, before you stumbled upon Super Affiliate Network, that there was some kind of story related, perhaps the person whose link you clicked, there was this story that you related to, right? When I got started online, it was a family, a traveling family that I felt so attracted to that I felt so, I was identifying myself with those people. And that made me want to learn more, right? So. That's why it's very important that you don't focus on all the others. This is what's happening in the beginning. Often when people go online, they focus on the leaderboards and then they look at the success and they, they want to follow um, you know, success because it leaves clues, but they get so overwhelmed that they think they're really not good enough and they get, they get frozen up and, and they're not moving anymore. And I want you to bulldoze that away and think, okay, you know, their journey is their journey Michelle's story doesn't have to be your story because you want to attract your audience to you. And that's the magic of attraction marketing. When your story comes in, in, the, in place, huh? when people find an ad, a link, a video, or everything that you can learn here in the Super Affiliate Network about how to drive traffic. So don't worry if you don't understand this word traffic. But um, as, as, as long as you start to create your story, um, you know, it's about you and not about the success of others. There are plenty of people 
who are more more related to um, to to people who are here, right? Brand new and starting, and just have the vision that they want to break free from their job, and not to me, uh, already working for years and years online on uh, in Costa Rica. So you have your own audience. You gotta basically focusing on attracting people like you. So <clears throat> with that being said, it all comes down to you. Now, the journey of transformation of others starts with the journey of the transformation of you. Because if you're brand new or if you haven't made a dime online yet, or if you made some, some income um, online, but you want to make more, it's about a journey of more transformation. You have to be better every day, become a better person, become a better marketer, learn skills, grow from the inside out. So your journey and your story starts actually right now, right here, right? And it's the key that you're going to share that journey with the outside world. And let me take a zip and that brings me to the next thing where a lot of people block and freeze and I'm gonna help you overcome that. So when it comes down to standing out of the crowd in the online marketing ocean is that people are more likely to share their story are more trustable in the eyes of prospects. So I hear a lot of people say in the beginning of their journey online, well, do I have to post things on Facebook? Do I need to make videos? Do I need to be out there and talking about this online thing that I started? And they say it with fear. And the thing is that if you holding on to that fear, you're going to miss out others out there looking for inspiration, people out there looking for people with the same vision such as you. So for example, if you have a job and you are a mom and I know who here is a mom? Who, let me say, yes, 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 who is a mom here? Here, there's lots of moms here. Okay, dads can say yes as well. Moms and dads, just parents. And by the way, if you're not a parent, it's fine too. But just an example, if you're a parent and you want to work from home for yourself, right? Then it is important that, that you just focus on that and that you start learning how to get there and, and don't be distracted by anything else. And there's more people out there like you. So there's other parents out there looking for your story, how you are transforming yourself into being that job slave to working online. And even if you haven't accomplished it yet, you're going to invite people to lock arms with you on your journey of breaking free from your job. And this is what I've done. So when people ask me or tell me, Muriel, it's so easy for you to, to attract people to your business. And then I say, well, I'm not really sure about that because it's easy always, but most people don't believe it. Well, why is it easy to, to, to invite people to join your business? It's because people are more likely to buy your vision than to buy social proof results. I, I swear my first all in sill online that was at that time a $5,000 commission I made it before I made not more than $25 online. So when that person asked me, what, what are your results? I just refused to answer that. And I say, well, it's not about my results. It's about your dreams. And I just said, hey, and I reminded that person to their dreams. And that was being a stay at home dad. So he saw my in my story, his story, I'm a parent, I want to stay home, I want to see my kids growing up, and that made him to make the purchase so I could earn a commission. And it was not because I could show an income proof. I didn't have any. I just invited people to lock arms with my vision, right? And does that make sense? That it's not about showcasing all hard proof and results, which is actually cool as soon as you have it, but if you don't have it, you still can have start your, your thriving online business. 
and, and, and start to build an, um, an audience. So I wanted to mention that and I will stop like all oh, golden nuggets like in between. This is my way of talking. This is my way of training. I didn't do a fancy PowerPoint. I'm, I'm really bad at that, by the way. But um, I want you to, to know that it's all about your authentic voice. And if you're not a parent, but you're, for example, uh, a plumber and it is your dream to, to fish all day because your passion is fishing, then, then your story will be probably very different. Like your, your dream is going to be quit your job so you can fish as much as you want and, and go to several places to fish, et cetera, et cetera. I bet that there's lots of others out there who have a passion for fishing, right? So just talk to yourself and inspire others and invite people to lock arms with your vision. And it starts with you. Now, where do most people go wrong? It's a couple of areas because we're all humans and I was there, everything I share is, I've been there myself. That's why I am able to share. And that's give me the authority to tell you that I know that you can overcome it because I overcame it and I know how. People are afraid to, oh, first of all, people think that they're not um, worthy enough to deserve the results and success. Who, who recognizes that they're not? feeling worthy enough, like as if you need to work hard or your family expects it from you. Or, you know, is it is it actually a good thing that I make a lot of money? Like, does it make me feel like a good person, right? Most people, and I was there, I didn't feel worthy enough to allow myself to make a lot of money. And that's weird because no one ever really told me that, but that's just brainwashed of the media, that's how we were raised. Like you have to work hard to make your money, right? Money doesn't grow on trees, blah, 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 blah. So just the only thing that you can do about this is to work on your personal development every day. So I'm working towards this point in my, in my training here that you dare to step outside after creating your own story, your vision, something to share with your audience to publish that on your everywhere, your wall and your videos and your marketing, the way that Super Affiliate Network is teaching that. So it's very, very important that you, first of all, start diving into your goals and dreams. And if you're new to Super Affiliate Network, hook up with your advisor because one of the first modules is based on you. What is it that you want? Why do you want to change it? What do you want to make? What does that money bring you that you can do now this is all about feeling worthy and the step-by-step -step plan is here in super affiliate network that's why i know it's working and super affiliate network knows it's working you have to go through these steps in order to create your authentic voice to inspire people out there even if you have no results yet you have to feel worthy and then start writing it down right start to start to to create a book and start writing also down your whole process of getting started online to where you're gonna be. But you have to have your vision, okay? So that is really important that you have to allow yourself to make that happen. I want, I want you to promise yourself that and, and just type below, promise that you allow yourself to make as much as money as you need to live the life that you want. Okay, don't let anyone tell you it's not okay to make a lot of money. And if you have a problem with it, read the right books. Uh, T. Harv Eker, The Secrets of the Millionaire Mind. There are tons of books uh, written about um, You Are a Bad Ass by Jen Sincero. You are bad ass at making money. It's all also about allowance, allowing yourself to, okay? Work with your advisors here at Super Affiliate Network. But you can also do this if you already passed that stage. Work, keep working on this every single day, okay? I do that too. I never stop doing it. So inner work, you need to do your inner work to be a better person in the, in the outer world, right? So if you start creating your story that you will be sharing with the world, like, you know, my story in a nutshell, like how I became uh, successful, how I moved to Costa Rica, making, make, making, making, making $20,000 per month on my property free, 
a property, a mortgage-free property in Costa Rica while I, you know, how I went from zero to being here, right? And overcame a bankruptcy, etc. Your story would be different, but you have to start, start with your vision, right? When I was still my job, I start to share where I wanted to be. So I want you to, if you haven't written your story yet, and if you start right now doing the inner work, allowing yourself what you want to accomplish, start writing down um, your personal vision that you want to create for your future, for your perfect day, actually, not the too far away future, but for your perfect day and start practicing that. Like, yeah, how, how I, um, how I will succeed in leaving my job to do X, Y, Z and making X, Y, Z to make that happen. And if you really believe in that and you're going to carry that out with, 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 with energy and with high vibrations, you will see how freaking scary that is. <laughs> One, that's why you need to just, you have to surrender to it. Because what that can bring you is that some people will spit you out. Don't care about those people because who will be paying your bills? Them? No. It's the people who feel inspired by you and they gonna follow you. And they going to think, what does that person have to say? I'm gonna pay attention, right? So you're going to attract people who identify themselves with your story with you and you can say you know what if you are like me in this xyz situation and you also want to reach xyz then just freaking lock arms with me follow the link that you see here around my post around my video learn more and get started today and let's do this together that's the energy that's why you already have a business even when you haven't got started yet if you are here I swear to you, you have a profitable, highly profitable business because you are so valuable. But if you don't see it yet, it's because probably like we started, you don't feel good enough. You feel not self-confident. You think that you need to be super techy. You need think you need to showcase all the results. No, no, no. It's about the vision, people. People buy your vision. They don't freaking care how the company is called. They want to follow you. But for that, it is, yes, the vision. I see people say, yes, yes, yes. It's about the vision. And that's why you all can and will succeed if you start using that. And then I come to my title of the training, like how to use a story to increase your profit. Because you're going to build your real estate online starting right now from scratch. Now I hear you say, yeah, but you know, I don't dare to do video. I don't dare to do this. I'm going to show you something where Dirk and I were when we got started online and there was not a super affiliate network that was guiding us in the right way because we were kind of lost. So you are already like hundred steps ahead of us, but I'm going to show you what we did in the beginning. And it was so crappy, but I'm going to show it to your, to your, uh, I'm going to show it to you. I'm going to share my screen. It's a very short video, but hold on. Oh, where is everything? Hold on guys. <laughs> oh, I'm going to grab my video that I already selected. And I hope that you can hear my, oh, first of all, can you see my screen? Look how, this is today, this is Dirk today. Look how he looked like years ago. This is four years ago. Look how, this is where we started guys, six years ago, winter coats. We all, we, you know, we started somewhere with our story. And this is what I'm going to share with you to help you overcome your fear of being perfect. You don't have to be perfect. Uh, Dirk and uh, my wife, uh, Muriel, and we are happy birthday. Welcome up. This is actually a blooper video. It took us like a whole day to record one of our first marketing videos that didn't work out 
And this is how we presented ourselves. And this is the foundation for our very first Momentum Big Sale because we just did it anyways. And I just want you to see how imperfect we are. Our website. My name is Dirk and this is my wife, Muriel. Nice to meet you. And uh, today I have no idea what to talk about. And that is our son who is crazy with a drill. He's going back. Hi. My name is Dirk, and this is my wife, Muriel. She's very shy, and this is her first time on video. Normally, she's naked. And a big Hi, my name is Dirk, and in the background, you hear my... Hi, welcome on our website. My name is Dirk, and this is my wife, Muriel. Nice to meet you. And together, we like to show you the way to freedom. And that is echt geluk. Hi, my name is... My name is... Yeah, I have it. Again. Oké. Oké. Nee, ik. Oké. Jezus. Ja. There's no I. Oké. Oké. Mijn naam is uh, Muriel Dijkma en dit is mijn husband Dirk van. Dirk van. Oké, okay, even over. Welkom. <laughs> <laughs> this is six my name is Dirk, and this is my wife, Muriel. We have so much fun because, well, we make our living on the internet. I am a former restaurant owner. This is my wife. I met her on the street. She was a, a, a prostitute. But I made her pregnant. <laughs> Dirk, and this is my beautiful <laughs> wife, Muriel. Hi, everybody. Nice to meet you. Uh, and uh, blah, blah. Welcome on our website. This is my... Welcome on our website. My name is Muriel, and this is my husband, dear. Hey, welcome on our website. Um, my name is Muriel. <laughs> we love to share this with you. Me? Okay. So, are you still with me? <laughs> uh, this is just an example of where we were, and it, it keeps going on where we were feeling imperfect, not knowing what we were doing, our English sucked. But what we start doing there, what we actually tried doing there is telling our story. Hey, this is Dirk and Muriel. You know, we're making our living. Well, actually we were not making our living yet, but we were figuring out a way on how to bring that like, you know, restaurant owner. But we started to, you know, this was the foundation. We started to share our vision. And we stopped caring how, how terrible we presented ourselves because you have to just drop it. I remember that my very first sale came through because someone clicked on her link because they felt attracted to that our English was imperfect because that person was French. And she was like, well, if you can do this and your English is not perfect, then yeah, I think that I can do it too. So by being authentic, no matter, you know, how it looks like, you have to start building your real estate online and just sending your story out, right? And I know a lot of people have fear for video. Now, if you look at my videos today, now you know where we're coming from, but you can only become better in sharing your story and in and sharing your division by doing it again and again and again. So in the beginning, we couldn't just even say our vision because we didn't know what our vision was. And then like you have all the trainers and the coaches here to start building your vision and know what it is exactly that you want to accomplish. That could be the start of your story that you're going to share in your marketing material. And the moment that you're going to see your first results coming in, you can build up from that scratchy story and build it out. So your story will evolve over time, right? So now we add it to our story. Well, it's when we moved to Costa Rica, it is that we, but a couple of years ago, we were already full-time online entrepreneurs, but we were still living in the Netherlands. So our story evolved over time as well, but you have you now and your vision. So it comes down now to start writing down your story, okay? Start writing down on a simple piece of paper. And with story, I mean, perhaps just keep it simple, your vision. What is your vision? My vision is, and just say where you want to be, where you want to become. 
uh, and then start with that. And the only thing for helping you to bring that message out there is by feeling self-confident of just doing it and stop caring about the people who don't support your story, but focus on one person that you can inspire with sharing your story slash vision. <clears throat> and that person could be your, your future longtime customer because their life can be transformed thanks to you putting your story out there. So if you don't press on with sharing your story anyways, in video, in writing posts, in whatsoever, then others are missing out. It's not just for you. You have to put yourself to the side. This is not about you, about how scared you are to put yourself out there. It's about what your prospects, your customers are missing out. And they're looking for someone like you. So if you think, well, my ears are weird, my voice is strange, or I don't know how to write, there's nothing wrong with your vision. The vision cannot be wrong. And I swear that there's others like you who have the same vision. So my assignment, who's ready for an assignment? Not to do right now. I just want to see some tons of yeses. Because if you don't take right, like after this event, not action right away with what you're learning, you know, it's wasted time. I, I You need to implement it. Start writing down as possible today with your vision and start to create a way of presenting that. Shoot a video about it like this, not like this, like this. <laughs> so you can use it for other purposes. You will learn later why. Like this and start recording it. Well, my vision is to be da 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 da. Start creating those habits. Listen to your own vision. Write it down and then start just sharing it on your Facebook wall in your emails, in your marketing material. It's gonna be the, the script for your bridge video. And if you don't know all these terms like bridge video or marketing material, don't worry, just dive into the super affiliate network training and you will learn step-by-step step what it all is about. But you are gonna be the foundation of the business, your story rules. That's why people are gonna, gonna, gonna love you, like you and trust you. And that is where the seal happens. Not by being salesy, no, people buy in by you. So write your vision down and the story. And if you already overcame something, add that to the story because that's the most powerful, right? So there could be, for example, I, I have a friend, she's a breast cancer survivor, right? And she is uh, she's starting online, right? And I advise, I ask her, are you, is that something that you want to help others with? She said, yes, for sure. But I've never knew a way how to bring that up. I said, well, just share your story, how you survived this. And that you're now like, well, I'm, I'm alive. And now I don't want to grind away working in a, in a, in a snack bar somewhere and not seeing my kids grow up. So I started my online journey and I want to inspire all other women like myself who are moms to lock arms with me girls and just that's her story. so she already has a story although she hasn't results online yet so i want you to write this paper full with your vision and if possible your story and then start inspiring others and make a call to action if you're curious to learn more lock arms with me follow the link and boom bring them to the next step and that's where Super Affiliate Network comes in. This is how you can sell anything. If you have something that converts at the back end, like Super Affiliate Network with this awesome coaches, don't do the selling and telling. Just do the story. The story and the vision selling. That's, that's basically the sharing. So um, work with your Super Affiliate Network advisor if you haven't done that yet and, and, and ha have them help you to you know, focus on that. And, and start writing that down, right? And then speak it into existence. This is like, we're getting now to the what to do. <laughs> I want you to make notes and do this because I'm gonna track you down and see if you're actually doing it though. That's actually a joke, but you have to want it for you and for your prospects out there and for your goals and dreams, okay? But I want you to start speaking your vision into existence your authentic voice so you're not gonna hold in because your sister is reading with you on facebook stop caring about others 
Your sister is not going to pay your bills. It's the prospects out there, right? Who need to read your story. And I told my friends and family who didn't, who were like, what are you doing now with all that online thing and personal stuff sharing? Well, first of all, you are in charge of what you share. You don't have to share everything, but just your story, your vision, make it compelling, write it down in a way that you think, yeah, actually, yeah, this could be an invite for others. And then just post it anyways. Because at the end of the day, it's all about you and, and your business and not that of anyone else. And just prove the others that you want to make this happen because that's what I've done. If I had listened to all those whiners and no sayers and people talking me out of that weird thing that I was doing now sharing a vision and my dreams about working online and walking away from my job. And I was like, well, I see you soon when I've done it. And then, you know, you are free to message me how I've done it. And I was like, I'm going to prove it, period. I'm not going to quit until it's done. So you have to share it with the world. And um, in order to overcome your fear, work on your personal development. There are so many books, personal development books. There's free audios that you can listen to, uh, you know, Napoleon Hill books. Uh, like I listened when I was on lunch breaks or while I was working, driving from address to address because I was a social worker. I picked themes for the week. Like this whole week, I'm going to listen to Jim Brown. The next week, I'm going to listen to Les Brown. The next week, I was, I was listening to Eric Thomas. The next week, I was listening to um, um, Abraham Hicks. Uh, you know, just pump your mind full with stories of successful multimillionaires who lived on the streets and were below zero to now living the life blah 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 that was where you should focus on and that's going to give you the, the energy to press on doing the things that's really scary but i swear of course you don't have to show yourself and personal stuff on your wall there's marketers who are pretty successful doing it without but I tell you, you're going to be more successful doing it with, because there's, I, out of experience, there's people I work with who met me with my story six years ago. And they stick to me as a lifetime customer because they attract, I attracted them with my personal story. This is not making a quick buck, people. This is about creating a movement and having lifetime customers because you are real and authentic and that's what people are going to love about you. But you have to work on the mindset to be powerful and strong enough to overcome that fear, right? And I see awesome, awesome replies. Uh, so I'm working towards this action list. So one is work with your advisor, work with your on your vision, start writing this down, create a compelling version, and then speak it into existence. Also for yourself in the mirror every day. Bam, this boom, 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 you know, rah, and then start sharing it in emails, on your wall, in your videos, just blend it in. And then invite people to lock arms with you. Important call to action. Just, do you also want this and this? Do you feel like how I felt or still feel? Boom, lock arms with me. Let's do it together. Five, make your Facebook role a place of inspiration for your prospects. Open it up. Make it public. Stop hiding. Because people buy from people. Stop hiding uh, I don't have to show my Facebook wall, but I tell you when people stumble upon my Facebook wall, it's colorful. There's no whining. It has positive quotes. I share things that I've learned. I did that six, seven years ago as well. It might not look with palm trees because I lived in the Netherlands and I have my winter coat on, but I was standing in my lunch break under my umbrella and I just listened to an audio on YouTube and I start sharing what I've learned. So I said, hey, this is Muriel. I'm so excited because I'm on this journey to break free from my job. I'm in a lunch break and I just learned this from Les Brown and I want to inspire you. And I start to shoot videos. And that video I sent to my email list with three subscribers on there, three subscribers. And I, I didn't, you know, it might sound not enough, but I start sharing those emails anyways. And this is how you build up from scratch to a movement of a, a lifetime a sustainable online business. 
really being that inspiration for others. You are the leader who help, who's helping others to transform by sharing your own story that starts with your vision, that will become your story of progress and personal development and build up from all the little results and the big results that you're going to gain along your way. Your first lead, woohoo! Now you can make videos about how you as a plumber found out that someone was subscribing to your email list while you never knew what an email list was. Like you can make videos about it with your workflows on and other plumbers finding your something online will think, well, that is so cool. I'm a plumber too. Now I'm curious what this plumber is all doing because I want to quit my job as well. So be the inspiration for others and um, make your Facebook wall a place of inspiration. So when you are doing paid advertisement, again, if this is all new terms, don't worry in Super Affiliate Network, there's training about it. Your advisor can tell you more about it. You don't have to understand what it's all about, but when strangers are gonna, are gonna find you online and they're gonna be thinking, what is this person all about? Give them a reason you know, to keep following you when sneaking in on you, on your Facebook wall, make it a place of inspiration and of the future you. It should be so energetic, like breathing of the person that your ideal person is, the future you. Don't lie about income if you're not having them, but just have the vibrations and the vibes and the energy of the person that, that you wanna be in the future, right? And that's gonna attract. And of course, I already mentioned it, keep reading personal development books and, and listen to audios every single day. Because if you don't, and that is the fact, then negativity takes over. So you have this limited spot, just see it like, it's a limited spot. And if you don't fill your head with information that's positive, negative information will sneak in. And that goes unconsciously, like in the news, people around you, the radio, I don't know, something happens. And before you know it, your head is full with negativity. And that's going to carry out as well in energy. So you have to be proactive and fill your mind with, yes, I love Grant Cardone as well. I see some, I see some, some chats passing. Grant Cardone is one. There's so many. Bob Proctor, Jim Rohn, my goodness, I have this book list that I completed and I'm still reading and books, I read books for five times. But, um, and then of course, mentorship overall, just grab the mentorship of Super Affiliate Network and, and don't bargain on your, on your own vision. And that means, and this has nothing to do with writing your own story, but um, if you, go for your dreams fully, you're also going to invest fully and you're going to find a way because if your vision is so strong, then the why will appear, but you have to just get started sharing your story, right? And um, if your story, you all have a story and a vision and if that can be your marketing asset, driving people to you, making you a dream income, how scary is it now? at the end of the day to do that. If that's what it takes with a good vehicle on the back, like Super Affiliate Network, a good affiliate program, solid, right? Qualified, then it should be not scary. It should be scary to not do it because then you're gonna keep counting on a job security, which is not there. You're gonna keep counting on others. And um, I want you to stop being afraid of being authentic and you. I want you to step up step up and just start sharing the imperfect you because there's no wrong with your vision. Now, I think that I came more or less to the end of my training. I wanted to highlight one more thing. Your story today will not be the story of tomorrow. Your story tomorrow will not be the story of the day after. It evolves. So just start where you are now with your vision and start sharing it and be yourself and by doing it time after time, making video after video, writing post after post, you're gonna be better. And in the beginning, it's gonna attract a certain amount of people. When you're furthering your career, you're having more results, you're gonna attract other type of people. But it's all about the attraction and you rule because you and I'm going to share that final 
that final thing and then I'm go oh, hold on let me where is that final chase your dreams share your vision share your story inspire and transform this is what it's about you should transform yourself inspire others this is a circle now I'm curious who can do this who will do this Yes, I see me, wood, wood, <laughs> I will, yes. Okay, give yourself a, a tap on the shoulder that you're awesome. And I think this was it. And I hope you learned a lot and thank you all and enjoy the rest of the, of the event. <laughs> awesome, Muriel, thank you so much, my friend. That was awesome. Would you, what did you guys think of Muriel? Put it in the chat section. Give Muriel some love. She is pretty awesome, is she not? Yeah, look at that. Good so Muriel, they love you. You are uh, you're something else, my friend. So uh, so much appreciate you and everything you brought today. Very excited for that. By the way, we're going to take a ten minute break, and before we do, I want you to just do this. Uh, I got a couple of things to pass on to you. Some messages from uh, directly from Misha, but I want you to go to the Facebook group for this event and give us a comment. Talk to us about what you saw with Muriel because she's going to be uh, checking that out. There's a post in there that she did. So make sure you get over there, uh, give your comment, give your feedback on that. It's going to be awesome. So make sure you jump over there as soon as we're done. Now, real quick, before you do that, we're going to take a break here. I want you to know that uh, when you guys uh, uh, pay for the ticket for this, remember, this is a free event. Um, if you decide that you got value from it, and you want to uh, pay for it, great. When you do that, not only do you get the event recordings, but you're also going to get the workshop recording. So the workshop from yesterday, if you guys got value from that, you're gonna get the, uh, the uh, recordings for that as well. The other thing, I know some folks missed out on the raffles, right? So your name actually got drawn, but you weren't here. What does that tell you? That tells me, holy cow, man, I need to stay focused, I need to be present be present because I don't want to miss out on that. So congratulations to Stan. I know that you got in there, buddy, because you were here. Rock and roll. Good for you, my man. Uh, follow Stan's uh, kind of uh, his role model there. Make sure you're here because uh, we're going to be doing a lot more raffles. In fact, at some point, we're going to be doing a raffle for a power day. That's going to be coming up this weekend. You absolutely don't want to miss that. A power day with Misha Wilson himself. Last thing. Uh, make sure that uh, you go to that Facebook group while we're gone. Go to our Facebook group, look for Muriel's awesome post, give her some love, give us your comments, and we're gonna take a break. So we're gonna come back here at 25 after the hour. That's 125 here on the West Coast, 425 on the East Coast, and everywhere in between. And Muriel, I don't know what time that is for you in Costa Rica, but uh, uh, we're gonna be back here in 10 minutes, you guys. Sorry, 10 minutes, not five, 10 minutes. We'll be back here. Have an awesome break. Get yourself over to the Facebook group. We'll see you back here at 25 after the hour.